Nafisa, you are here again as a WNBA All-Star, Team USA. Just how does every single time you're in this position feel different than the last? Um, I think with USA here, it especially feels different. You know, last time I was here, it was my first Olympics. And so the second time around, it's it's really fun. I'm excited to have the full Olympic experience. Mm -hmm. All-Star Weekend is always so fun. I love seeing everyone's outfits. Um, and I think it's going to be a competitive game tomorrow. So it'll be fun. Now talk about outfits. You, you come through with the outfits too now during All-Star Weekend. What's your favorite part of the weekend? Is it just the fits or is it the camaraderie? Like what's your favorite part of the weekend? It's definitely the fits. I'm not going to lie. I love seeing everyone's <laughs> outfits. Everyone's style is so different yeah. and everyone always shows out for the carpets and everyone looks so good. Yeah. We only see each other like in sweaty in our uniforms and stuff. So to see us looking like so dressed up, it's fun. I love that. Um, you mentioned that you, you know, a multiple Olympian at this point. What do you or do you give advice to some of the first timers, some of the newbies? Like what are some of the things that they should, you know, keep in mind as they're getting ready to go over to play for Team USA? I haven't really given advice. I think I'm still one of the youngest on the team, if I'm thinking about everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, but, yeah, I mean, I think everyone understands. Like, I have not played with this specific group, but I've played with everyone on different teams mm -hmm. at one time. So you get that your roles are different on this team. You get that we are here to win a gold medal, and so you'll do whatever it takes to get that. So I think everyone's really good at recognizing that. So I don't know what advice I would even give them. That makes that makes tons of sense. Um, I love the fact that Kayla McBride, who has been your right hand this whole season, is now your opposition. <laughs> so there's got to be some type of wager, some type of bet. Like, what's the trash talk like? Like, how is that dynamic now that y'all got to play each other? <laughs> she knows we're going to win. I, mean, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if she's going to say something different, but in her heart, she knows we're going to win. <laughs> so... I have loved the way that women's sports have continued to evolve. And you are playing such a major role in that with Unrivaled. Give us the scoop. Like, what else should we be expecting in Miami? Because I'm trying to come. Yeah, you should come. It's going to be awesome. See, I mean, more player rollouts, so you'll see more names soon. Mm -hmm. uh, the fan experience is going to be amazing. Like, the content behind it, we are micing up players. We're doing podcasts. We're doing docuseries. We're doing everything, like, so in-depth. So it's going to be really cool for the fan. Um, and then for the players, too, you know, we're offering historic salaries historic mm -hmm. contracts um we're really changing the game so i'm excited i love the rollout i think i was the only one who got ryan howard right because it was a bunch of doves and i was like oh that's a zeta that is Ryan." see i didn't even know i don't know who they're gonna put for the next one so i didn't know what that was i instantly got it but then i don't think too many people got it and yeah. then the social person was like so we really can't go too deep with the hints yeah hilarious yeah. so <laughs> so that was really good um so let's play a quick game because I'm one who loves the Rising Stars Challenge, but we don't have the Rising Stars Challenge in the WNBA. So I've come up with my own Rising Stars Challenge. I'm going to show you three photos, and then you have to tell me who these people are. Okay. But they are all all-stars. So Team USA and Team WNBA. Okay. All right? Okay. All right. This one should be easy, but who, who knows? We'll see. Okay. All right. Pressure. Here's the first one. That's AT. She has the exact same hair still. <laughs> <laughs> That's AT. Totally AT. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> that is... Is that like NECA? NECA? Yeah. NECA. Mm -hmm. You know you get Chanae as like I was, a Yeah, bonus. I was like, <laughs> I was like, there's two of them. Yeah. It, there's Chanae as yeah. a bonus. Okay. This one is a trick. I'm giving you a clue. This, oh. this one here is a trick. Okay see <gasps> mila oh my gosh that picture is so cute too she is an all-star yes. she's an all-star reserve yeah she is <laughs> oh my gosh when you when you think about her and the way that women's sports is growing and just how women are totally getting the respect and love we deserve like what is the one thing that you just want her to know um I think what it looks like to follow something you love and to work really hard at something, to be successful at it. Um, being surrounded by so many like amazing, powerful, successful women, mm -hmm. I think is amazing for her to grow up in that. Um, so I'm really excited, you know, to grow up with not only my team, but when we get to places like this, like other teammates and the greatest players to ever play. Yeah. So I think she's two now. But when she yeah. looks back, I think she'll appreciate it. I love that. Well, good luck to you. Good luck to Team USA. I have no idea. that. I mean, I have no doubt that y'all are going to get gold. Yeah. Thank you. Period. <laughs>